Hi there, it's Trees, and today we are building a room for Ella. So I've started with my cereal box and some paper for the flooring, another piece of cardboard from an old project, and two more pieces of paper that are going to be the walls. So I'm going to get started here. I've attached the bottom paper to the floor and this purple paper to the back wall, and I've just folded up that piece that I didn't cut off. Now I'm going to glue this side on, and just like that, we have the shape of our room. Our next step is gonna be deciding on furniture. So this little closet I built a while ago, there's a tutorial in one of my shorts. I've just added some of the little decor for her room in it. Um, I'm gonna put it along this back wall. I haven't glued it yet because I haven't totally figured out the configuration of the room, but that will be coming up. Okay, so next step is our window. From the dollar store, I have this little paper room and I'm just taking the window off the back and I'm gonna cut it out and put it on this wall so she can have a window in her room. Super love how the curtain matches the walls, so let's do that. Next after that, I'm going to add a little desk with a computer and a few other things and this little pallet bed that I made. So the bed is constructed with these little craft boards from the dollar store and the little blocks from the dollar store. I've just glued the blocks to the bottom to raise it up a little bit. Then I added this pink blanket and I sewed this little colorful throw and those matching pillows. There are tutorials, but I can do another one in depth so that you guys can see how to do that. Then I've glued the closet into place so it is there permanently now. I just put some hot glue and pressed the back wall against the closet to hold it in place. Then I've added this last piece of furniture. It's a little desk, a second one, with more of her little brushes and phones and whatever. And now you have her completed room. I hope you've enjoyed watching and I'll see you again next time.